The book of Faith 25 verse 8 says, No man has a right to dress up until the wife has dressed up. To read First Timothy chapter five, verse eight. What does it say? If any provide not for his his own, his family, yes, especially for those of his household, he is more than an Ambropa, an Ambropa from an Ambra, from Abido, from Delta. Is worth than a number of them. That's what the Bible is saying here. What does that mean? Brother, your wife did not be a very good cook. She may be the staff in the kitchen, but take care of her. She may not know how to communicate. Make sure she dresses well. Let her dress to honor you. Let her dress to honor you. The Bible says you have no right to dress up until children have dressed up and your wife has dressed up. If you're here this morning and your wife is also here, look at her. If her dress is not the best she has, she's reporting you to me that she's married to a man who does not care what she wears. And you discard your husband. But you make him a slave to 
without the man knowing it's your slave. Okay. We'll take one more play. Let's go to the book of Job. The book of Daniel, chapter 2, verse 22. The book of Joel, chapter 12, verse 22. Let's take those two places. I've been spending time talking about what you must hunger after. Whatever your heart desires will determine what you become in life. We'll take those two, then we'll take two, go to number two. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The, the, the Bible says, this day of you heal the deep. How do I say it? There is what makes, what makes a preacher a great preacher if it's a man of imagination. What makes a man a great man and being a man of imagination? I want to say, any man of imagination, don't count him out. Any woman of imagination, don't count her out. Now the Bible. Even if you, even if your wife earns more than you do, that's your own money. You tell her how much you love her. And if you're intelligent and wise, you learn how to go from a wife. And that's when you can. <laughs> the, the worst thing that is to have no money and not know how to communicate skillfully. <laughs>
how, how, do I, how do I say it? There is what makes, what makes a preacher a great preacher if it's a man of imagination. What makes a man a great man and like being a man of imagination? I want to say, any man of imagination don't count him out. Any woman of imagination don't count her out. Now the man, even if you, even if your wife earns more than you do, that's a good money. Tell her how much you love her. If you are intelligent and wise, you don't have to go from the wife. And that's when you can't. <laughs> the, the worst thing that is to have no money and not know how to communicate skillfully. <laughs> I'm not 